hi guys and welcome back to my channel so today i want to talk about something that i've been struggling with no not personally <laughs> but i don't know if you guys have the same issues that i have but candles that burn out like right here or even if it goes all the way down and you still have all this wax and you're just like okay i guess still smells good maybe i'll just keep it for decoration or toss it how many of these do i have hmm one that's undone another one <laughs> i threw away a couple yeah so before i threw start throwing them away because by the way i got these from pottery barn I love Pottery Barn candles. I buy candles mainly for to make the house smell good. I do have candles that are unscented, but I love the way these look. They're pretty, but unfortunately, they stop like right here, and you have all this left and all this. So, although it smells so good, oh my gosh, you know, I decided let me figure out how I can still get the good smelling with a burnt out wick without having to try and remake my own candle. So, using this as an example, <laughs> I cut wax down. I cut some of the wax off and I figured if I melt some of the wax off and put it in something, then it would permeate the room. Oh, guys, this candle is What's this? Oh, it smells so good. Um, Mission Fig. And this candle is called Kints. Q-U-I-N-C-E from Pottery Barn. And they are $29 a piece, I believe. So, yes. I cut some of the wax off and I purchased this. All right. So, I purchased this. A, um, what do you want to call it? A candle wax warmer <laughs> but basically it comes with this yes it's hot right now it's not super hot but I'll, I'll zoom in on it so you can see that the wax is take a moment just oh it smells so good that the wax is melted and i just keep this on all day and oh my gosh it permeates the room beautifully. It has a switch on and off, and my husband is like, man, it smells good in here, strong. It's phenomenal. And just to show you how much, how much wax I used, just that amount, and it melted. And I've been using that same melted wax for the past four days, and it's still full, pretty much. But of course it's going to evaporate and I'm going to take some more wax off and put it in there. <laughs> and this, these come in different colors, but oh my gosh, you can put your, uh, if you buy like Yankee Candle stuff, those ones that are in the glass, you can put the glass on top of the uh, warmer, but OMG, change my life concerning scenting my home instead of continually rebuying these, I was buying one for every room okay two for every room <laughs> and because they first of all they're pretty and so now all i can do is really i don't have to light this one i can just use them as decoration and look really pretty as i chip away at the ones that are all blown out or burnt out and they end up me melting them and i'm gonna put one in every room now because they're amazing and it doesn't get too hot and I turn it off at night. Some people don't, but I turn mine off once I go to sleep, but turn it right back on in the morning and it's amazing. So I wanted to show you guys how I deal with burnt out candles that you that smell good and you still have all this wax and what do you do with it? So yeah, I hope that helped you guys. Just a quick tip for me. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching and have an amazing day. Bye, guys.